short implants are as successful as standard implants in the long run. The 5-year survival rate of 96% for implants less than 6 mm are similar with traditional implants with 98%. Besides, there is no risk of complications during or after surgery due to procedures such as grafting that are required in some situations to insert standard implants at sites with severe bone resorption after tooth loss. This is a big advantage from a clinical aspect. On the other hand, some important disadvantages cannot be overlooked. Since the implant is short, the amount of the threads is less and when bone resorption occurs in time, the survival rate decreases. Although their survival rates are similar to standard implants, the risk ratio is 1.3 when short implants are used. In other words, some additional precautions have to be taken in the clinic. Adjacent short implants should be splinted, cantilevers should be avoided, the diameter should be at least 4 mm, and immediate loading should be avoided since there is lack of information on this issue. In mandibular complete edentulous cases, if bone height is greater than 10 mm, Two standard implants are sufficient for an overdenture prosthesis, while four short implants are more advantageous if the bone height is less than 10 mm. Even though one or two of these implants would be lost in the long term, the denture may still be in function.